everyone. Welcome to October 7, 2014, Tuesday. My name is Xeen Shadow, but you're in your and uh, today, I'm eating hot Cheetos. And then I have another bag over there, too. That's something else. Okay. That's not what I want to talk about. As you can probably tell from the title, the thumbnail, most likely maybe the thumbnail. <clears throat> Super Smash Brothers for the Wii U has finally got a release date. They have finally announced it. Now here's something I want to know. <clears throat> I said like maybe a couple days ago, like two, I'm thinking. Who knows exactly. Of when two or three, I really don't know. Of when I wanted Smash Brothers for the Wii to come out. I wanted it to come out in December. As you can tell, it's not December, but next month, December. Or, I mean, November. Sorry. <clears throat> so, it comes out in November. But, this is the more interesting thing. In Japan, it comes out in December. Yeah. Here's the thing. It comes out November 21st, 2014. <sighs> November 21st, 2014, that's the same day as Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. I believe. I'm not sure if they changed the date on that or not, but... That's, uh... Pretty, um... Crazy. Already, Nintendo's big in November. <laughs> when I think of it, Nintendo starts with an N, and November starts with an N. I think it's the only month of the year that starts with an N, so I can I can I can say I can see that I can see that the big N, but it just kind of blows me away that. <laughs> Do I have the money to get these games? I'm seriously thinking I should cancel my pre-order of Sonic Boom Rise of Lyric. And cancel a Pokemon Alpha Sapphire. But I have a plan. I have a plan. This plan might not be foolproof, but it's a plan nonetheless. I'm not going to say it, because I don't want to jinx it, but... It's a plan. <sighs> this is where it's going to get interesting. For sure, I can make the deadline for Bayonetta 2. I can. And... <sighs> it's just November. That's just going to kill me. Now, for Smash Brothers, I know I pre-ordered a $100 bundle. I have this coupon thing that can take off $50 off it. It's great. <laughs> That's great. Now, I have to see if I can use another coupon. I think it's not going to be like two coupons. It has to be like probably one coupon per thing, but that's going to kill me. It's going to kill me. And the way I'm seeing it, partnership money, you have to just help me with getting the extra games of what I want. The partnership money really will have to help me with that. Like, really. Like, as you can tell from, like, the Swamp Meet last Sunday, like, two days ago, I showed you what I got. <clears throat> there weren't anything expensive. But, it said so many games I saw at the Swamp Meet, I couldn't purchase because of, I know what's coming out later in the year.
It's going to get crazy in here. It's going to get hella crazy in the next month. God damn it, dude. It's going to freaking turn crazy. Okay. Okay. Uh, I want to point out something before going to the next topic. Because there's going to be mostly two topics in this video. My anniversary for daily vlog is coming up. Now, a lot of you might be saying, Shadow, daily vlog anniversary was actually October 1st, 2014. We passed that like seven days ago. That was for Halloween month. I was test running to see if I could pull it off. I found out that I can. That I can. And it worked, of course. So, my anniversary is November 1st, 2014. And I gotta go see what the freak I spoke it back a year ago from that time, but it's not the first yet. It's not first. I just kind of have to think... Yeah, I kind of have to think in a way... What did I learn from that point? From a year? I have to see. It, it's not anniversary just yet. Like I said, I have to wait at least another 30 days. <sighs> why, why I say 30 days? Another like 20 something days for sure to see it. To see what I have learned. In a year. Right now when I'm just thinking about it, just briefly, I have learned several things, but... I want to literally see what I have learned literally than the things I just think of right now. It's going to be a long, bumpy way, but I know uh, daily vlog from when I started, I was working on Dollar Tree, and it's almost been a year since I started from Dollar Tree. I'm kind of actually more curious of what the hell I said on the first day of November. So, yeah. Anyways, the next topic I want to talk about really fast is Fatal Frame for the Wii U. Sad news. I'm hearing it's not coming. Sorry, I'm seeing something in my, in my freaking eye or something. Okay. Okay, good. It's not coming outside of Japan. It's Japan only. Why? Now, several people might say it's probably not popular here in North America or Europe or Australia or Power Rangers, anywhere. That's most likely maybe true. It's not going to be a console, sell sorry, a console seller or anything, but it does make you think why? <clears throat> There's already a cult following all the Fatal Frame games, honestly. I'm st scared to shit out of those kind of games. And I'm considering getting it one day. But the thing is, I would like to see if it still holds up for the remake from the original from, like, what, PS1, 2? I would like to see that. But, I really want to know if you guys want it to come to North America. Or Europe or PAL or wherever you are. I think it should. It should. If game companies keep seeing it like, okay, we shouldn't just bring it over because probably no one will love this game. That's like the worst thing to think about. Doesn't video game developers and publishers want their games to be noticed. Of course they do. But how can you do it if they don't market it right? Yes, maybe there's some games that has nothing to do outside of Japan or outside of North America or Europe or etc. Like let's say uh fucking 
let's say an anime comes out in Japan only, and it comes out for a specific console, and that console is not supported over here for that game when it wants to come out over here when the anime is actually finally running. Uh, let's say, oh, uh, um, <coughs> Soul Eater, that anime, it was big back in 2000 and something when the PS2 was irrelevant. Now it's not. And Soul Eater is now pretty big here in North America. And no one can play the games because it's only on PS2 in Japan. There's there's moments like that that I want to try out these games, but they're only Japan only. And, and my consoles can't play freaking region-locked games. Not all of them, of course. Like PS3, of course, they can. I think uh, it was a freaking... I don't know what else, but it was freaking something else. But it makes me kind of pissed that a lot of these games we're never going to get, ever. In case you ever want to do a, re a remake or actually want to port it to another console or something for people to enjoy. Or the downloadable content games or downloadable games, I mean. XBLA, Wii U, eShop, 3DS eShop, PS3, PSN, X. Friggin' Xbox One, PS4, PSN, Marketplace, whatever. All that stuff. <clears throat> and yet, we're never probably gonna know if we're gonna get it. That's a sad thing. Uh. So. You're probably all asking. Shut up. Smash Brothers has been out for about a, uh, not a not a week. It'll be officially a week on Friday, or or something. But it'll be officially out in a week. And you're probably saying, "How far are you in the game?" Shut. Well, I locked every single character in the game. I'm not stages. I know a lot of people have probably done that. I, I don't have that much time. I am also catching up on things I wanted to do. Like, there's new TV shows on Netflix now, which I'm going to talk about the next thing, which it will most likely be the last topic of the vlog, and then I'll be it. So, I was just giving you a little update on Smash Brothers. So, I need to lock every single stage, and that will probably be it. Oh, I'm getting all the trophies of the main characters, of course. All the characters. And I think that's probably really it, other than Smash Run and what's not, but whatever. Uh, yeah. Anyways, uh, the last thing I want to talk about really fast is that The Walking Dead Season fucking 4 or something is now on Netflix. How the hell do I know? Well, I was watching uh, Baby Daddy on Netflix earlier today when I was, when I was ready to go to work. And... It just I, I just look at the popular section on Netflix and it just shows me oh my god Walking Dead, and I should have remembered Walking Dead season whatever continues on uh, AMC or whatever it is, and of course whenever the new season starts they like to add the last season onto Netflix which I am now gonna watch, but I'm not sure if I'm ready, because, well, a lot of things, I should be ready, because it's Halloween month, and it's one of my biggest months of the year, but in a way, I don't want to be ready, because I am afraid. <laughs> so, I'm actually going to probably go watch an episode of it after this vlog, and or catch up on whatever else is on Netflix, because yeah, there's a lot of things on Netflix, and I'll talk about this stuff in a future vlog, I can't say tomorrow, because I'm not sure what I'm going to talk about tomorrow, but in the next couple days. For sure I will. For sure. Not positive, but... Eventually. So, really, uh... That's really it for today. So, recap. Smash Brothers for the Wii U is, has a release date for November 21st, 2014. Fatal Frame for the Wii U is probably going to be a Japan-only game because uh, Koei Tecmo has basically, in a way, announced saying there's no really big fandom around the world only other than mostly in Japan. Oh, sorry, mostly in Japan. And number three, The Walking Dead season whatever is on Netflix. Yeah, I'll, I'll put the actual season name in the title, but I don't remember what it is. It's like four or 
five. I don't know. Four. Let's, let's go four. It's not, it feels like it's a four. Anyways, thank you all for watching, everybody. So uh, don't forget to like the video, subscribe, leave a below, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Where I watch a bunch of shit, which I'm probably going to do right now. No joke, I'm probably just going to go watch a lot of videos, or movies, or movies, TV shows, videos, etc. Because there's a bunch of new stuff on Netflix, which I'll tell you guys tomorrow, okay? Or I mean not tomorrow. Eventually, sometime in the next couple days, weeks, for sure in this month, time, period. Subscribe. <laughs> okay, once again, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow, okay?